Well, he made a career out of fighting fires, but a St. Clair County man recently found himself in a battle he couldn't win. No, those would be bees taking up residence in his home, so Tim Pamplin took the night cam to help with an eviction notice. Yes, you could say that's a large honey bee hive. It's enormous. It's on the side of Dave and Charles Hosk's home in Port Huron. Dave is a retired Selfridge Air National Guard firefighter, got injured on the job. They're living on fixed income. After I pay all my bills, I have like $40 a month to live on to buy groceries, buy gas. They simply don't have the money to deal with this colossal problem. And that's where Joe Tillman comes in. Joe, the best bee and wasp service in Southeast Michigan, brings out his thermal camera and says, yep, I can take care of this for Dave. So Joe and his business partner suit up. Yeah, I got a good sign. When they heard this couple were in need, he didn't think twice. How are you guys? See, now this is a story, not so much about a bee's nest, but about community. When the Port Huron Township firefighter heard about their brother in need, they came out, offered support. If you're retired or you've left after your years of service, we will come from one another. This story all started with this man, Dante. He owns a lawn service and heard about this problem. Nothing he could do. So he got in touch with us and we got in touch with Joe and this story's ending is as sweet as the honey. He may have a day or two of activity of the drones leaving and coming back, but after that he would not have no more problems. We took care of it. Thanks to everybody who chipped in to help Mr. and Mrs. Husk to do with their enormous beehive. That's the scene in Port Huron tonight with the night cam. Tim Pamplin, local four. Boy, that honey looked good. I'd it? love a review of the honey too. Yes, the bit of we honey. We should tell everybody at home the bees were not killed. Yes. They've been relocated to a bee farm in Lavonia. A bee relocation program. Exactly. <laughs> All right, Tim. Great story.